Hey guys, Sweetie Bow Hunter here. <clears throat> I haven't I haven't made a video for a while now. Probably since well not since postseason. Since the beginning of gun season after after I got my doe. I got a doe in Litchfield, private land. <clears throat> Never got anything with bow though. Uh, but it's uh I think it's a twenty it's a twenty third today. Um <clears throat> So two days till Christmas, and the season ends for gun and for bow the 31st. So it's coming down to it. It's coming down to the end now. It's muzzleloader season and bow season, and landowner rifle. But I don't own land, so I'm not hunting with a rifle. I'll probably I might be able to get a couple of videos for you guys. Um, bow hunting. I might go out state land behind my house this week. But yeah, but it's also muzzleloader season, so I picked up myself a Traditions Pursuit muzzleloader. Show you guys. Kind of a... I don't know, I can't, I can't, I don't know if you guys can really see it that well, but it's actually a pretty nice gun. Here, hold on. I don't know if you'll really see it any better now. Well, yeah, a little better, but it's an inline muzzle loader. It's a Traditions Pursuit. Has a scope on it, a Tradition scope on it. Break action. It's got real tree camo. Stainless steel barrel and receiver. Came with a Traditions three, three to nine by forty zoom scope. Yeah. Haven't shot it yet, but I probably will be setting it in this week. It has a good feature. It's a, called the accelerator breech plug and it just screws out with the primer in there and you can just see it clear just push instead of having to shoot it every time you load it you just you can just empty it out from back there it's got a safety on it when the safety's on you can't pull the hammer back when it's off It's actually a really nice gun, and it wasn't uh, it wasn't all that expensive. It was only two, I think two sixty, and then everything that I bought with it, I bought the triple um, seven pellets, which each of them fifty grains. It's probably used two of those hundred grains, <clears throat> and then the Hornady uh, Hornady Sabot. Those are two hundred two hundred fifty grain bullet. Just shoot out, shoot out pretty good. Should be pretty accurate and a good heavy hitting round. It's got a nice. It's got kind of a funky. Yeah, you probably can't see in there, but it's kind of got a funky reticle and a scope. It uh, it's like a not a range finder because it doesn't have the ranges on it, but it's got different like levels of crosshairs for different yardages. I I haven't shot with it yet. I I don't really like it, but. It shouldn't be that bad. I just have to get used to it. But yeah, it's my new gun. Pretty nice. Uh, I should be able to get some videos for you guys this week. Like I said, probably be going out. I don't know. Maybe not. Probably not Christmas. Not tomorrow. Actually, I might go out in the morning tomorrow with my bow. But yeah. Give it a try. I might be going to my friend's house this week to sight this in. And then next Saturday I'll be going to Litchfield with it, hopefully. Hopefully. Maybe I'll be able to get one with a muzzleloader. That'll be pretty cool. 
I could get a vi maybe get a video of sighting it in this week for you guys. So yeah, if I don't talk to you tomorrow, uh, have Merry Christmas, to all you guys. Have Happy Holidays and Good New Year. And <clears throat> I'll try and get some more videos for you guys. Alright, see you guys later.